in some inner city. When the papers came to the kids, have to see from the they don't have to read the press, but they knew the answer. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A boy did a calculation and got three for the answer. There was no for the paper. There was a two, two point five, three point zero, three point five. He could not find the answer. <laughs> <laughs> That's why there's so many inner city kids in Campion. But, they're properly bored. I'm sorry. 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 I just made it with a champion result, result is like, don't tell you where they're coming from. Now, I've seen school that is, I've never heard of before. Sir, like, this lady was like, her daughters were the first to come from that school and about how camp and people are teeth. They did get out of the primary school, some place in Boystown. Where? Boystown, just some place. <laughs> Boystown, <laughs> in, in the jungle, <laughs> on the garden side. <laughs> because, <laughs> because the kids, don't have money or any such thing. And it's understood because they are inner city kids. The only meal they eat for a day. The only meal they eat for a day is what the school provides. Some program called Path or something like that. Yeah, the, the milk kind of thing. This is sunshine. They pull out people. Hold on. This is sunshine. Each child is coming out of a big bowl like that, filled with rice. This is white rice. There's this thing looking like a chicken neck. Turkey neck, sir. No, it's a chicken neck. It looks, no, turkey neck like a big fat neck idea. But oh. Check it at about the length of that. And it sits on top of the rice like that. And everybody's coming out with that. This is what they're going to be eating. Oh, I mean, but this is bad. So they all went into a room and I went in and said, hey, everybody, hi, sir. You are lunch? Yes, sir. What did you have? Chicken back and chicken neck and rice. So was it good? Yeah, it was nice. <laughs> <laughs> I said I was almost moved to tears. It's ridiculous. The only meal for the day is why they are sent to school. Oh. And then a few came late. <coughs> That's how they encourage them to go to school. You know the good friend I call Uncle Mrs. Grace the red nephew? Yeah. That's the side. They were locked out because they came late. Oh. Why are you late? I don't take my little brother to school. Little? <laughs> I took my brother to school and I was eating. It's ridiculous. So what you see around you is like, I mean, eat and all. They have lunch like, go tell me. Sorry. I can't eat it. 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 Like in Papin, sir? Well, if they are in like, you know, they are in like, who is child of them, say, Dan, Joan, so stuff like that, but they'll be like, God. Yeah, you'll you, you get hoisted up and, but I mean, you can pass that paper. Sir, is it? Swat, steam, anything. With a meal like that every day, that's a big crazy. Sir, it'll be like St. Jago High Winning Schools Challenge School, right? St. Jago. St. Jago is supposed to be a good school in Spanish of you. Because every year I must have taught me these in school. Yeah. I mean, the top school is, for example, Manchester High. 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 Man